I hope that you're enjoying your virtual experience at WOCN Next 2020. My name is Dr. Cynthia Sylvia, and in case we've never met, I'd like to introduce myself. I've been a certified wound ostomy incontinence nurse for most of my career, which is longer than I'm going to own up to. My career transitioned from direct care to managing clinical affairs in the medical device industry. After being awarded by nursing doctorate, I started Cynthia Sylvia LLC. My clients are industry partners in healthcare. I'm supporting Conshore Medical and I will be meeting and greeting you in the exhibit hall on their behalf. Let me share some information about Conshore Medical. It's a healthcare technology company founded by Nish Chasmawala. Nish is an engineer by trade, but he's also an inventor of innovative technology products, and his passion is healthcare. Consure has brought a much needed product to market for the care of the patient with fecal incontinence. The name of the product is Quora. It manages the flow of incontinence by implementing a unique stent technology design. What first drew my attention to Quora was what it did not have. Quora has no internal rectal balloon and no catheter tubing. Those two things made an immediate impression on me and made me want to know more about it. Perhaps you would also like to know more. As one member of an intimate educational and distribution network, we coordinate clinical evaluations and assist with supporting value analysis primarily within acute care organizations. My intent is to tweak your interest so that I can lure you into the exhibit hall. Let me share three reasons why you should come visit us. First, prevention of incontinence-associated dermatitis. Second, infection control. And thirdly, what I think is the most important reason, safety. Managing fecal incontinence internally with an effective conduit protects skin integrity and greatly reduces the occurrence of IAD and subsequent pressure injury. Let's consider infection control, especially during this challenge in caring for patients with COVID-19. The research is now coming to light that viral RNA has been detected in feces. It remains unclear whether the virus in feces is infectious and might be an additional source for transmission. At any rate, the core is a closed system with one-way valves for flushing, administering medications, and obtaining stool specimens. The collection bag has a sheath for no flashback and a charcoal filter for containment of odor. These features should be considerations for patients with COVID-19. The efficiency of CORE minimizes nurse to patient interaction during the pandemic. Regarding safety, CORE has a safer insertion and withdrawal process than current devices on the market with a hygienic applicator that avoids digital insertion. The stent technology minimizes radial pressure exerted against the rectal wall and preserves sphincter tone, mitigating risks such as mucosal pressure injury and weakened sphincter tone. Both harms associated with internal rectal balloon catheters. Finally, by employing a sheath for passage of incontinence. There is no tubing and the risk of medical device pressure injury is eliminated. So there you go. It's all about skin integrity, safety, and infection control during this pandemic. I look forward to seeing you at the Consure Medical Exhibit Space. I would like to thank you all for doing what you do, not just during the challenges of this pandemic, but every day, being committed to your patients and being advocates for them. Hope to see you soon. Thank you.